Hello. <laughs> it's been a while since I did a video like this. Um, I really want to talk about a new album in this video. Um, and that's why I wanted to make this update video. It's not going to be the story of the album. I really want to focus on a, a special video for that and focus on the story of the, the album and the songs and some background information. Um, I want to talk a little bit uh, uh, about the album in short, uh, tell a little bit about the music, about why this album is coming out and what it means and what, um, uh, what the short story is <laughs> behind the album. Um, but before I'm going to do that, I first want to thank all of you for uh, taking the time to watch this video. And um, I also want to thank you all for taking time to listen to my music on Spotify, on Bandcamp, on SoundCloud, wherever you can hear my music. So I want to thank all of you for listening, to take the time to listen to one of my songs, to the albums, to watch the videos, to uh, watch one of the podcasts that I've been a guest in. Recommendation is uh, the Music Smoothie. I've been a part of, uh, I've been a guest on that podcast for... Um, a couple of times, uh, I think maybe five or seven times already. It's been a, it's been so much fun to be on that podcast. I will put a link in the description so you can listen to it. Um, it's a podcast with uh, with a group of people. We talk about music um, and about songs, what we think of it, uh, if we like it. I've discovered a lot of artists thanks to them, so um, it's really worth listening because if you want to discover new music then uh, that's the podcast to listen to and also it's it's a wonderful group of people to uh, to do the podcast with as a guest um, if I'm a guest on the on that podcast so uh, check that out um, I also will put some other older podcast interviews that I did uh, also in the description uh, if if you want to listen about the stories of uh, previous albums and stuff like that so um, and the music overall um, and then the update <laughs> yeah the album um, first the background of the album uh, this started back f last year uh, in May uh, when I was joining um, I think it was May I'm not completely sure uh, to be honest but uh, I joined the clip writing uh, the song <laughs> the album writing club uh, what was a project or a, a contest for making an album or an EP in a month time and um, it, it was so much fun to do that it was so much uh, it was so interesting to do that and um, that I, I had an idea already for the longest time and wanted to focus more on an a little bit more experimental with ambient and neoclassical sounds kind of EP and that's what I made and um, it were five songs one three of the songs are still on the album to be uh, to be clear um, only not the only one song has the original name the other songs has have other names now because it didn't fit anymore with um, uh, with uh, with the whole style of the album but I will get to that point um, the EP so I made five songs for that <coughs> and um, yeah, uh, I really enjoyed it. The people were very positive, uh, got great reactions on, on the song that, um, that people could listen to. And um, I didn't win, but to be honest, I, I enjoyed it so much more to just join this, this, this project and this uh, contest. And it really gave me the idea um, to work on new music again. So I got to the, to the point of making that EP. So um, I released the EP. And I was thinking like, okay, you know what? The EP is done. Um, I'm, I'm proud of it. And I want to release it with the label. And Andrew from um, um, Monogram Motive was very positive about it too. Asked me to make it a little bit longer because it was a little bit too short. So I, I found it no problem. And I wanted to focus on that uh, and make the album a little bit longer, add some more songs. But at some point I was like, you know what? I like this EP, but if I want to make an album, I'm, I'm going full on right now. Um, I'm not gonna add two more songs and leave it at that. So I go back to the, uh, to the EP, look at the songs, listen to the songs. And um, yeah, some of the songs were, were very uh, interesting to me to keep in the, uh, on the album. 
but it also needed a lot of more uh, new music. So it ended up with, um, if I'm correct, 16 songs. <laughs> um, it's one of the longest albums that I've ever made. Um, but there's a reason that it is a longer album too, because um, the whole concept of the album is different than uh, the other albums that I did before. Uh, it's it's a semi follow up to uh, New Noir because it's uh, a more personal album again. It goes where where New Noir was about the the darker times and the uh, growth and the fears and the uh, being scary and the anxiety of of everything. This is far more positive, and I can tell you that this is <laughs> based on real life. I'm I'm surprised by things how things are going, and and the last couple of years were. Uh, sometimes rough, but I've learned so much, so much about life and about stuff and about myself and um, the, 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 the biggest goal and the biggest gift that I got was um, accepting yourself and, and finding self-love and finding uh, a way to, to step out of the comfort zone and to be more open towards other people and it's, it's been a journey and that is what this album is all about, about the journey. Um, I, I really focused on, on, on personal things with this album. Um, some of the titles are even more personal, I guess. Um, and the concepts, or the, uh, not the concepts, but the idea behind the album was, uh, was not clear for me in the beginning. I was like, you know what, how do I want to make this album and how does it fit all together with all the songs? Like, it's going to be a mess if I just put this song there and this song there and on and on like that. Um, so at some point, um, I was watching uh, some Wes, es Wes Anderson movies, uh, <laughs> Asteroid City and The French Dispatch, where those movies that I watched. And the, the um, idea behind the films was like it was in three parts. And at some point there, there was this click like, I know how I want to make this album, I'm going to make it in a three part structure so the beginning is the signal the second part is the cave of, Mem the cave of memories and the third part is new beginnings um, and every part of that album has its own kind of style i think the uh, first part is the more experimental darker style the second part is more um, more ambient um, and the third part is more uh, neoclassical and 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 also some more experimental uh, flows are coming back from the first part so that's was the idea behind this whole album like i said i'm not going deeper into the album with songs and the, the songs that are on the album if if the album is out i guarantee you there will be a new video with the story of uh, the signal of the universe um and with that i guess that i've told everything that i want the album will be out very soon uh, I'm I'm really really looking forward to this album release, um, and and like every artist will ever say about every album that he makes, it's going to be the best album that I made so far. <laughs> no, but I'm I'm really really proud of this album, um, especially because it's more, again more a personal album, more story driven album for myself. And again, if if you listen to this album, if your own stories with it, I'm also very very grateful and very very thankful if you. Uh, let me know and if you want to share like the stories that you experience with this album uh, it also means a lot to me um, the the albums are always an, uh, a way for me at least to to say the things um, that I cannot say <laughs> in words so um, that's what this album uh, what it is and uh, like I said it's going to be a far more positive album than a new noir album but was about the more darker times uh, with this album I, I wanted to make it also a little bit more grand if, if that's the right word for it like I wanted to have something like okay it's more open it's more vroom vroom this like um, it's it's not as, as as closed off with with simple instruments and and simple sounds and stuff like that um, but again, you're going to be the judge of that and how it's how it is uh, when the album is out um, The most important thing for me is always like the reactions of other people Because I can like the album, but if other people don't like it, then I really need to work on things 
Um, but I'm feeling really good about this one. I'm feeling really, really good about this album, and I'm really looking forward to release uh, release it um, the beginning of November. Um, that is when when it's planned to be out. It's also going to be. I, I almost forgot. It's also going to be released with the Monogram Motive label. Uh, so I'm very, very, very thankful for giving me the opportunity to release it with that label. It's always been a dream to release an EP with a label, but an album is a uh, really step up from that. So, um, yeah, um, thank you for watching to this the, this video. Uh, I hope to do more <laughs> of those videos again sooner um, and not five years from now. Uh, I want to thank all of you again for watching this video. It means the world to me that that some people take or that people take time to uh, listen to my music, to listen to uh, the podcast that I'm a guest in, uh, that people watch those videos. So thank you, thank you very much, and hope you have a great day. And uh, I will uh, see you in the next one. <laughs> all right, bye bye.